Today, Gravel and Gold is going to do a bit of apartment snooping with our dear friends Virgo Paraiso and Tino Rodriguez, local artists here in the Mission District. We left the yard and then we put all our stuff in, <laughs> in storage for a couple of months, like a month. And then we, I call and they're like, oh, did you know? I'm like, no, what? The whole warehouse in New York. Oh. How about the fire? <laughs> about the fire? I'm like, oh, what fire? So apparently the whole warehouse was caught on fire and but everything, everybody lost everything. It was, th there was not one brick left. Well, I had everything, everything, all my paintings, drawings, photographs, slides, my whole life, except for my actual life, which I think <laughs> the most valuable thing, right? I mean, I can always do everything over. But, um, like, well, I, 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 I want to go there and see if I can rescue something because there was no imagery of my work left, nothing. I just put all my eggs in one basket, what you're not <laughs> supposed to do. <laughs> and uh, they're like, they, that's what they said, there's not one brick left and I like, can't be. So for like a month and a half, we thought we didn't have they're it. like, there's one last chance, there's one last truck that left and when it comes back and then the truck came back, no, sorry, no, it wasn't there's there. nothing. And you've been working so hard to build this up, and all of a sudden I'm like, what are we doing bad? Are we bad people? Are we doing something evil? I thought, that's the, I can't, this karma is not right. I was really pissed, actually. So they called him and said that we needed to pay rent for storage. And he called me, he's like, dude, uh, they called me for your, from your storage saying that you need to pay rent because um, it's, it's due, it's past, it's past due. And I'm like, huh? And I'm like, I'm confused, you know, and, um, He's like, yeah, your staff is in San Francisco. I'm like, what? I'm like, Cesar, are you sure? Well, he had this face like, like, oh my god, Virgo, it. oh my god. And I was like, fuck. I had just gotten used to the idea that everything's fine, you know, I'm, I'm doing good. And, Virgo, and Virgo I thought, like, like he something. hit somebody or he crashed the car or something, <laughs> ran someone out. It was like this face. And I was like, no, I mean, on top of what happened, something else. I was like, you it know, sucks. it's too much. And it was like, Everything, you know, the stuff is okay, it didn't burn. I'm like, what are you talking about? It didn't burn, we have everything. Yeah, I just couldn't believe it. I know, it was hard to believe it. Yeah. We're like, we, st we still didn't believe it until we got here. Like, let's call them and see if it's true. It was all our, all our stuff kept dodging like, all these fires. You know? We were like, uh, what? So, it took us like a month and a half to find this place. Yeah. And the landlord was hiding when we came here because he didn't want to rent it yet because he wanted to up the rent a bit more because something mm -hmm. and it was like perfect for us we were like ah oh. so the 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 lady downstairs at the store at la casa de los años she's like oh i know him i can call him hold on and she was really sweet actually mm -hmm. she really liked this she called him and said there's two people that want to see the apartment and he's, he was there and she was like oh there he is and he was trying to hide was and then it was too late because he, we had already seen him and he was like uh hi oh, that's his <laughs> Now I have all this stuff, but I'm not so attached to it, you know. Mm. It's stuff that I really love, like every little thing, oh, I love this, you know. But if I lose it, it's like, you know, I can always get an hour later. Or yeah, all the art books, which have been, you know, I'm so, like, I love my books. Oh, the music. Jeez. Lots of things. Lots mm. of beautiful stuff. 